So my neighbor Gary's an alien hunter, as we all know, and he's great at it. I mean, he finds them and he treats them however they treat him. A little golden rule. Uh, treat the people you, the way you want to be treated. Aliens have tried to screw with him before, so he's really hurt him in a big way. But what I was talking about with Gary after he offered me a beer the other day, as he was smoking a ton of pot, like just J after J after J, like... If you don't know Gary, he's kind of like the Michael Jordan of pot where like he is going to crush it in the clutch. But I was like, Gary, so aliens, the ones that they're disclosing right now are bullshit. What else is going on? He's like, I don't even know. Like up is down, down is out, sideways is a corkscrew. And I'm like, I feel that. We all do actually, Gary. The establishment never wants to let anybody relax, do they? And Gary said, no, no, it, it like, you are supposed to feel like shit all the time because the Satanists, the commies who are like running the show, they want you to feel like 10 tons of garbage. So you don't go out and like meet uh, somebody pleasant and then like go on dates and walks and like maybe you have a little bit of wine, a little vino. And I'm like, that sounds pretty nice. Like, why, why won't they just let us like live our lives. And he said, well, because uh, they worship the devil. If like they could suck them off, they would. And I think that a lot of guys and girls, they they would try and they would just rake a rusty dagger over their open palm while they dripped candle wax all over their bodies. And it's just like, grow up. And and I wouldn't think that that would be the feedback that you would give somebody who is like doing that while dripping wax all over themselves. But Gary's an expert, right? So I said, Gary, moving forward, what's like, what's the game plan? And he said, you just got to stick to the people close to you. Everybody's going through it right now. And you got to ask good questions. You go out to people and you say, hey, like, how's your, how's your spirit? How's your heart? What kind of a week are you having? Would you like to get curly fries? And I just, that was like one of the best things that anybody's ever said to me ever as advice. Like I need to offer more people curly fries. If you're aligned with this, follow the account, drop a comment and say, I'm into curly fries, but I'm also into friendship. And then let's just like have a lengthy discussion on why all that's important.